want us to trust you. But urban renewal, as you call it, for us has meant urban removal. Fiery debate tonight at Tulsa City Hall over two proposed urban renewal plans for North Tulsa. Two Works Views Loring calendar shows us the sides of the emotional debate and what's next for the council. Residents, one after another, pleading their case to the city council on two urban renewal plans in North Tulsa, saying they were blindsided. No one has discussed what's going to happen, but more importantly, we didn't even know about this. Nearly 50 community members signed up to have their voices heard, many living in homes passed down from generations, hoping that history doesn't repeat itself. Urban renewal in the 60s. Our home was torn down and an old home replaced that home. A little paint was thrown on it and that was called renewal. For the Crosby Heights and Greenwood plans, Tulsa Development Authority says as a last resort, they'd use eminent domain and potentially condemn houses for development purposes. But residents question why they're focusing on homes when North Tulsa economically has been ignored. You have not seen anything come into Tulsa, even a grocery store. After several hours of public comment, TDA offered to host town hall meetings in an effort to increase communication and transparency. This doesn't work for TDA, the city, or our citizens. We need to be hand in glove in this thing. These plans were tabled indefinitely. City councilors also called on the development authority to, quote, radically reform the way you do business and inform the community. Loring Callender, two works for you.